Hi, I'm Kristen. Welcome to Bailey Cabin. I'm so very glad that you have joined me today. We have a new bark box. I am upstairs in the craft room today and our friend Pete isn't supposed to really be climbing stairs. So he's not here to bounce around while I open this but it may be that he arrives when he hears squeaking, so don't be surprised if he shows up. Here is this <laughs> month's theme. We have bark. What? Glasses, can't see the small print. What's the password, pal? Okay, so we usually get two or three toys and two or three treats. And oh, we have the night at the Squeak Easy. I wanted to get this open so he can play with his stuff. And have the treats. But downstairs recording is not going to work tonight because it's already getting dark. Scoob. Oh, okay. So it is in theme with the Scooby-Doo movie coming out. It says May 2020, but as of right now, I don't think most movie theaters are open. I have a referral code, which I will also post down below in the description and oh it's a limited edition scoob bark box we're gonna have to look into that and you can see some of the things included in that which includes the mystery machine which looks super cute okay back to the squeak easy we have a liquor bottle, it appears. It's the Pooch Hooch. It has a nylon strap, tube scoop squeaker, and crinkle. <laughs> I think I hear somebody coming up the stairs. Yep, here he comes. You want that beat? Okay. And <laughs> Flo the Flapper, look how cute she is. Oh my gosh. What is that beat? I'll try and get some additional footage of him because he's right here and you can't see him. Oh yes, he's so very excited. Flo the Flapper has crinkle and a disc squeaker. So good. And Pete is very impatiently waiting for her. And then, <laughs> this is Betty Bootlegger. Appears to be some sort of spider. Uh, crinkle and ball squeaker. Yes, Pete's very excited when the squeakers go. <laughs> I just love their themes. They're so cute. Barry and Clyde. This is by Bark. These are squeak easy treats. Soft baked dog treats with blueberries and bacon. We also have Anna down here now and a kitten or two. <laughs> I'm up higher than usual. Um, oh my gosh. I'm doing a bark box treat or a bark box unboxing. So those are pretty good size and they are crumbly. Pete says it's good, but he thinks everything's good. It's kind of big for Anna, the Chewini but she seems quite interested in it. So we'll see. Seems good. Okay, and then we have duck soup. 
which are duck recipe dog treats with pears and cranberries. These are sourced and made in the USA also, which I appreciate. Okay, these guys are little strips. Sit. Good boy. Anna's still working on the first one, so she can have more later. So those are the two bag treats. And then there's always a stick of some kind. So this is the soft and chewy peanut butter carob stick. Peanut butter. Anna's still working on the first one, so I'll just give Pete a... Oh, he's back to the toys. What do you think of this, Pete? A good sit. It smells like peanut butter. It reminds me of, there's some peanut butter thing that human treat that it reminds me of. Hmm, I can't think of what that is. I wanna show you. There's a bunch of different um, toys that you could have gotten. And if you want to go to the BarkBox website, you can order those additionally. And let's see. Okay, so that was our April 2020 Bark Box. We have the little spider guy going back to Pete. We have the, they're really slimy. He loves them. He really, really does. And these are so tough. He can get through a stuffy really fast, but these bark box toys, and this is not for the chewer. This is just the regular bark box. They last a really long time. So I appreciate that so much. Um, okay, this was the pooch hooch there's his bottle of booze there you go pp and <laughs> she just cracks me up uh flow the flapper and then we had the two bags of treats and the stick so all of that for 34.95 you know usually you're finding dog toys the quality ones for $14.95 or something like that. So get a whole lot of good stuff for your dog every month. And I think Anna's ready for another treat. Can you hear that? What'd you say? <laughs> okay. So thanks again for joining us at Bailey Cabin. I hope you are well. I hope your family's well. If you are a um, essential worker. Thank you for being out there on the front lines. We so appreciate your needed service. And if you're home, I hope you're with people that you love and that you're um, Zooming with people frequently or you're enjoying the dining time, however that looks like to you. Take care. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.